Hey everybody, Anthony here, and today I'm reviewing this bipod from T-World. I received this product for free or a heavily reduced price for my honest and unbiased opinion, because you guys know with me, that's exactly what you get, my honest and unbiased opinion. Questions or comments, feel free to leave them. I will respond, and of course, I'm going to leave all the hashtags, links, and everything that you need so you can check this out online for yourself and make your own decision. Uh, I definitely give it uh, four stars. Uh, I would recommend it. A uh, pretty decent little bipod here, and I'll go over everything and show you what I like, don't like, a whole bit about it. Um, but here it is, uh, and I, I've got it set up like this so I can use one hand to uh, hold the camera and the other to demonstrate. But as you see there, uh, and it's fully adjustable, uh, it goes on the pick rail, uh, and that's what that is there. So uh, thumb adjustment screw here on the side. Uh, that's going to slide in, that's going to spread over and then slide onto your pick rail, uh, and you're good to go. Uh, depending on how you want it, whether you want it uh, facing out towards the barrel or facing back, uh, you know, either way is going to be, it's going to work either way for that. Uh, but you simply just depress that and then it bends back. So you can have it facing out towards the barrel, you can have it facing back, depending on your needs. Um, down here, uh, these are just screw. Uh, nice, as you see the 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 roughness on there it's easy to grab a hold of uh, and it just slides and pops out pop uh, and that's going to add some extra uh, length there and you can go online like I said I'll leave all the hashtags and links so you can check out the dimensions and see if it's going to be right for you and what you're using the shoot with so uh, but nice rubber feet uh, easy in and out um, and, and I really do like it it does not come with a rail uh, so you'll need to have the rail already uh, but everything else is, is good to go. Uh, there is no adjustment as far as how far out you can let it. It's either all the way in or it's all the way out. Uh, same with here. With your adjustments, uh, there's no uh, uh, going side to side. It's either up or down. Uh, so that's that's what's going on with that there. Let me straighten both these out here uh, so you can see if I can do this with, with one hand. Bear with me here. Uh, I want to show you this fully extended out. There it is right there. Uh, so I'm going to put my hand here so you can get some kind of idea about the, the size of this thing. So it's definitely going to add some height, um, especially if you're shooting on a range. You're not, you know, you could use this instead of a, a front sandbag or something like that for, um, for sighting in or target practice, things of that nature. Of course, in the field, uh, you know, it, it's adjustable. So uh, whether you're all the way up, all the way down, uh, it's going to give you two different... Um, two different uh you know uh, finish points uh to, to shoot from so but all in all t world you know go online check them out it's all in all a really decent uh bipod um and and i do like it definitely give it like i said four stars out of five i uh, wish it was a little more adjustable but that is okay it is what it is uh and for the price like i said a great bipod so go online check it out t world's the name of the company and we'll see you guys next time thanks